Hello, my name is John Pelfrey. Welcome to the third in our series of training modules. Today's session is based on our power control unit, the AC4, linking back to the web of energy and using our thermal storage tank. Today's session is all about how the AC4 can control energy management and place that into the tank. So what is the AC4? Essentially, it's a power control module. You can see the shape and size of the device that acts as a go-between um, relative to our, our um, thermal storage tank and an array of solar PV panels. It can be used with um, a number of, of inverters and also suitable for any residential application uh, by being able to provide up to nine kilowatts all the way through to a commercial or industrial facility uh, up to 99 kilowatts. And when we're talking that sort of um, consumption level, you're starting to think in the realms, for example, of a, of a hospital facility. Um, so a, a go-between, being able to control and, and think very much in relation to where power needs to be instead of into a grid, can be drawn back and basically provided or, or delivered into our, our thermal storage battery in the form of heated water. So in effect, the AC Thor provides a self-consumption opportunity um, in relation to solar PV yield. So in addition to what I've covered so far in regards to the AC Thor, linking it back to the web of energy, I wanna now um, take you through these illustrations that show how the AC Thor is physically connected and used in conjunction with our, our thermal storage battery. Essentially, you can see in the, the thermal battery, the image showing the, the three heating elements, the AC Thor being the go-between in relation to the, the solar PV yield, and the um, way that the, the control module is functioning in regards to the, um, the power meter, the MyPV power meter, and also the, the inverter in the actual system itself. So a very simple design, a very clever design, essentially the AC Thor providing the thinking process in relation to the, the supply and distribution of the energy that's gathered from solar PV yield. Thanks very much for your time today. We hope you've enjoyed the module on the AC Thor. To keep up to date with other training modules that we're, we're going to be doing in the future, make sure you visit our website, Thermal Energy Solutions, and also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Thanks very much. See you next time.